So in this video, we've got a particle of mass 2 kilos sliding down a smooth plane inclined at 30 degrees to the horizontal. Find the acceleration of the particle. OK, so let's draw a diagram. So here is my inclined plane. Here is the particle. OK. Um, it's inclined at 30 degrees to the horizontal. And it's got a mass of 2 kilos. So the weight working vertically downwards will be 2 times g. OK. We're going to have a normal reactive force, normal reaction force, R, working perpendicular to the plane. And what we're going to want to do is we're going to break this weight force up into its two component parts. OK. One that is parallel to the plane and one that is perpendicular to the plane. So this angle here, remember, is going to be the, the same angle as that one there. So the opposite side will be 2g sine 30. And the adjacent side will be 2g cosine 30. OK. Now... Because uh, the particle is sliding down the smooth plane, the direction of the acceleration is down the plane like that. OK. So, because the surface is smooth, there's no friction. So, when I'm doing this, I want to resolve, OK, and I'm going to say parallel to the plane. Okay, so resolving parallel to the plane, we're using Newton's second law, F equals ma. Okay, so the net force is just the weight. Okay, that 2g sine 30. Okay, that's the only thing that is making it slide down the slope. Okay, the gravity pulling on the particle. There's nothing working against me. So that is the net force, and that's going to be equal to the mass times the acceleration A. So I could cancel the twos on both sides. And so the A is just G, gravity, which I'm going to take as 9.8 times sine of 30 degrees. OK. So... Uh, 9.8 times sine of 30, and that gets me 4.9. So the block will be accelerating at 4.9 metres per second per second. 